Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. How's everybody doing today? Hopefully everybody is doing well. In today's video, guys, we are going to be doing an unboxing for a release that I am extremely, extremely excited to be doing because first off, it was fairly difficult for me to obtain and I was very happy to finally get in the collection. And of course, I am talking about the Enter the Video Store Empire of Screams box set from Arrow Video. First off guys, let me explain to you why it was a little bit difficult to obtain. Most as most of you probably know this item was uh very popular and sold out very quickly and I had an I and I had this item pre-ordered. I don't remember which site I pre-ordered from, but I had it pre-ordered thinking I was going to be able to get it. Got an email saying this item is uh not available. Uh we will let you know if it comes back into stock. And I was like, well, shoot, I don't want to wait for that because it's a limited edition run. I don't know if they're going to print more. So I was, of course, then scrambling to all different sites. I went to Best Buy, uh, Diabolic, a bunch of different websites, uh, Target, uh, and it sold out, sold out, sold out, sold out, sold out everywhere. And I went on to Barnes & Noble, and I saw that there were a couple of stores that had it, uh, in in store you couldn't get it online it was sold out online but there was a couple stores that had it in line or had it in stores and so i went on to the one that was closest to me put in my uh, re reserved it and got an email a uh, short time later saying this item is no longer available and i was like oh shoot like am i not gonna be able to get this am i gonna have to pay some ridiculous secondhand price on like ebay or something like that and so then i Saw there was that one other store which was still there, put in the reservation, and finally I did get an email back saying your item is available. I think it must have been the only one that was still in there. And so then I went over to a Barnes & Noble that was about 15 miles away from my house and went and picked it up. And I got to tell you, I am so glad to now say that this is part of the collection. Uh, so yeah, without further ado, guys, let's bust into this thing let's unbox it and let's see what's all inside all right let's get the uh let's get this wrapping off here oh it smells nice nice new nice new box very cool so as you can see here we have the uh we have this little slip cover that's on here and it's a very cool Outside, it has a picture of outside the video store with all of these different um, characters from all the different movies. As it's, it turns around to the back, you can see it tells you what uh, the contents is, what all the movies are uh, on the back. And it gives a short synopsis on everything that is included on there. When you flip it over, you can see the very top has a listing of all the films that are in there and then we take off this slip cover here put that over there and even more beautiful artwork the front is the same you get around to the side is the same and then you get around to the back which has more fantastic artwork and then you can flip it over onto the top and you can see it's the top of the video store and it says, you're never too old to play with toys. Very, very true. Very true. So it is a very beautiful set. Uh, right off the bat, I will say it's, you know, it's like Arrow Video always does. Nice, hard, uh, very durable box set. A lot like a lot of their special editions like that I have up there. Um, always, always great uh, with, their, with their outside box sets. And then you take the top off. And this is beautiful to see. Everything has its own case. That's the way it should be. I can't stand those box sets that like stack discs or just have it all in their own little like slot stuff. This is how you should be doing it in its own individual case. So then you get five movies here. You get the Dungeon Master, Dolls, uh, Cellar Dweller, Arena, and Robot Jocks. And then you get a booklet on uh empire entertainment each movie comes with new and old reversible artwork along with lobby cards two-sided poster and this fantastic arrow video magazine book
Now, I'm not super familiar with uh, Empire Entertainment. I've seen a few movies here and there as far as this box set is concerned. I've heard of Dungeon Master, Dolls, and Cellar Dweller. I've only actually seen Dolls, which I love Dolls. Dolls is a, is a great, great, like, Friday night, Saturday night, late night, uh, 80s horror movie. It's... But it, it's silly and fun at the same time. It's it's a lot of fun. I really enjoy dolls. Uh, the rest of these sound very, very interesting. Um, I'm going into most of these fairly blind just because why not? You know, I mean, I don't want to know too much about it. I think I might have looked at maybe some still images of a few things here and there. But every one of these just look like a good old time travel back to 1980s video store Friday, Saturday nights. Uh, this would be the type of stuff that you would get. I myself personally didn't see dolls till like way, way later. I saw it like two years ago for the first time. So none of these are like nostalgic for me, except for more of the aspect of uh, just an actual video store and going there in the 80s and the 90s and renting stuff on Fridays, Saturday nights. Uh, but particularly these movies, these are not really ones that are overall nostalgic for me. But I think they're going to have the style and feel of other movies that I have seen and did rent uh, back in the day, back in my video store day. So I'm very, very excited to delve into this. Uh, overall, just first thoughts and impression. Overall, my just my first thoughts on this is this thing is just beautiful. It's great packaging. It's very nostalgic, fantastic artwork. I mean, I don't know why I would think any differently from Arrow Video. They always just, they seem to impress more and more and more every single release that they do. I'm never disappointed. And this one is definitely no exception. Uh, I haven't really delved into the movies to know what the transfers are like or what I even think of the other movies. Uh, but this one, I definitely think as far as like re best release of the year so far, this one is probably going to be a contender. I mean, just based on just, I just noticed that now it's a VHS rental. I guess I didn't even notice that the first time. Yeah, there's so many things in here that you can kind of look at inside. I mean... That, I mean, you know, all the stuff that's going on inside the store. You have the little dolls up there. I mean, just very cool. They just, the small little attention to detail that Arrow always does. Just, it's so appreciated by us collectors. And it's just so nice to see. They Obviously, this is made by fans for fans, which is awesome to see. But yeah, overall, just from first thoughts, I mean, this is going to be a contender for so far one of my favorite releases of the year. I'm kind of a biased opinion, though. I mean, I love box sets. I'm a sucker for a good box set. So anytime there's a box set that comes out, like one of my favorites that came out a few years ago, like that was my favorite release of the year, that Friday the 13th box set, uh, which was put out by Scream Factory. It also does, you know, fantastic work. But uh, yeah, overall, just first thoughts. Uh, yeah, just everywhere you look, it's just so cool. So cool. Uh, first thoughts, this thing is awesome. Great packaging. Uh, I didn't really delve too much into the bonus features. I can probably put the slip back on. But I'm sure this thing has a bunch of bonus features on it, like uh, Arrow usually tends to do. Yeah, we can put that up there if you want to pause it. I am definitely not going to read all of that, but feel free to, um, to do all that. I will probably do another review once I actually get through and watch everything in here, which most of these movies are probably pretty short. You can probably get through this thing in an afternoon, I would guess. Uh, but yeah, overall, just, I mean, even the small things, I mean, on the slip, like just putting the titles of the movies on there, just small little detail. I didn't show the bottom out there is really anything to really show, but, uh, there it just has the rating and, oh, does it say how long they are? Uh, no, but, uh, oh wait, yes, they did. So, Oh, yeah, they're all extremely short. 77 minutes, 77 minutes, 78 minutes, 97 minutes, and 84 minutes. Which I'm assuming it's the listing that's on here, which is uh, Dungeon Master, Dolls, uh, Cellar Dweller, Arena, and, and Robot Jocks. Uh, I'm assuming that the ratings uh, correspond with the order in which the movies are in the box set. 
Uh, but very, very, very cool release. And I haven't even delved into the movies yet. Um, but overall, just presentation alone, I mean, I definitely give this thing an A+. Uh, unfortunately, it's pretty hard to find. It's pretty much sold out everywhere. I don't know if they're going to be if they're going to be doing more copies. Uh, the one thing that I think is going to be really cool because Empire Entertainment does have a lot of movies in its catalog. So I'm hoping I, that they'll be able to get the rights and put out another box set like this, like the, uh, what is it, Giallo Essentials? The Giallo Essentials uh, set that Arrow does where they have multiple releases. It'd be nice to put out Enter the Video Store, Empire, you know, like this one's Empire of Screams, maybe Empire of, you know, something else. Or It'd be really cool to see multiple releases of Empire stuff done in this fashion i mean obviously this one was immensely popular and sold out very quickly uh but yeah um if you can get it i definitely recommend just by just the presentation alone this is very cool uh you might have to pay second hand prices i don't know if they're gonna do any more of them or not but uh and good luck to you if you do try to go get one because obviously i mean i i think so far it's fantastic but i will watch them all and give a full review uh at another date so but yeah guys that's all i got for you today if you like this video give it a big thumbs up let me know you guys like what i'm doing like share comment subscribe all that fun stuff and let me know in the comments below did you pick this up were you able to pick this up are you still attempting to pick this up have you seen all these movies in here what do you think of these movies what do you think of empire entertainment let me know in the comments below guys uh thank you so much for watching you guys are amazing as always and i'll see you in the next video take care bye